President Trump says he's very close to picking a new FBI director. As we mentioned, one of the frontrunners may be former Senator Vice Presidential Candidate Joe Lieberman. Our senior Dust correspondent Pierre Thomas has more on where the search stands right now. Good morning, Pierre. George, good morning. Lieberman was the Connecticut Attorney General before he served 14 years as that state's U.S. Senator. First as a Democrat, then as an Independent. He was the Vice Presidential Vice presidential pick of Al Gore's failed race for the presidency in 2000. But in recent years, he's shown a more conservative bent, endorsing Republican presidential candidate John McCain in 2008. After leaving the Senate, he's recently been working as a law, in a law firm uh, in Connecticut, George. And, Pierre, this really has the feel of a trial balloon. I wonder if he's really going to get the nod. But so far, what, uh, what kind of reaction is he getting from Capitol Hill? Well, Republicans like Lindsey Graham and John McCain are praising him, but some Democratic senators are skeptical, saying they don't want anyone who's been a career politician in charge of the nation's premier law enforcement agency. FBI agents I've spoken to are hoping for someone completely nonpartisan. But, George, if Lieberman is selected, he could receive re support from within the FBI because he was his state's chief law enforcement officer. Right, but some inside the administration wonder if he might be a little bit too independent. We'll see what happens with the president's pick. Pierre Thomas, thanks very much.